recording? I can't see because I don't know if the LED's on. I'd presume it is. But anyway, how are you then, my good friends of YouTube? Well, today I've uh, been messing around with an X-ray transformer. Um, well, it's an X-ray core with a ferrite core. Um, I think you might have seen it some time ago. Um, I'm going to be putting a little bit of more voltage in it than I usually do. And I'm using a ZVS driver to uh, power it. Can I just see a leak? So it's raining outside. I've been up there and sealed bloody screws and now I can see it's flipping leaking again. God damn it. <sighs> Don't you hate tin roofs, tin sheds, plus they, they do nothing but bloody leak on from every single screw hole. I mean, there you go round to bloody, uh, well, I'm not going to flipping go into it anyway. It's not feeling boring, you're all that. Ah. <laughs> but anyway. And we're using a ZBS drive with two IRFP 260s in parallel. It's the larger one on the big heat thing just there. And uh, the 4.7 microfarads UF cap on there, whatever you want to call it. So I'll show you. There we go. You've all seen this before. Uh, and some other uh, foil wrap caps just there. The phone's not going to flip him focusing on it because it's absolutely shite. Well anyway these are 400, uh, 470 nanofarads uh, at 375 sorry at 600 volts. Uh, just going to zoom in, uh, focus in, there we go. Anyway this is the bit where I'm going to be pulling an ice arc. Sticking about 40 volts into it. This is going to be pretty damn mad because uh, with those caps on and the way it is with the output it's seriously awesome you get a pretty decent outcome from it but, uh, but yeah did you all enjoy the video with that <laughs> I actually had a really good output from it last night I was uh, peeing about with it and uh, it was like streamers of corona all the way around the wire and it got that bad it was actually burning the wire so I had to uh, stop where I was doing but I had this um, this strike ball just there a bit further away and I was getting like three feet arcs jumping to it and it was just unbelievable it was like going straight down it was hitting the transform uh, box just over there I've got a bit of a vacuum going on at the minute in that box um, and it was like striking that striking the bits of um, metal down here uh, it was striking the bloody doors and the a um, bit of noise dampening material just there which I had to keep my eyes on because th that would just go <laughs> straight up in flames but anyway let's uh, stick baby beast on I'm not using big beast today I'm using baby beast because it's got a rectifier inside of there so are we all connected? we are right let's, just... let's get this one a bit closer to it to start her off. Very red hot. That's thirty seven volts. A little bit more. Oh, damn it. What just went pop? Ah. The cap got too hot. I wonder if it was still giving out, but... See the wires, because they're so thin, getting too hot. Yeah, it's killed something. You know, because the initial cap coming off, it's uh, it's given a little back back spike to something. Ape, I've not blown a MOSFET because this is a bitch to bloody to get apart. And I've had this apart so many times because um, they're blowing things. But from the output, from the way it was there, I would suggest either a, a Xena diode's gone or one of the actual MOSFETs has gone. Oh, that was a shame getting quite a nice output from that then, won't I guys? Ugh. 
massage. She's a beast, isn't she? Can't wait to get some more of those. So anyway, guys, I thought I'd share that with you. Nice little bit of um, ox there for you. Hope you liked that. That was about 42, knocked it up to about 42, 40, 44 volts just then before the, the capacitor unfortunately came off. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Look after yourselves. Be safe, whatever you're doing. Please rate, comment. Please, you guys, um, give me some more thumbs up on my channel on me videos because uh, I don't get very many thumbs up and it would be nice just to see a, a few more thumbs up and those ones who want to thumb me down I don't mind <laughs> take care guys speak again